Hello, I'm Claire Bridge from Sky News with First News Today on Tuesday the 14th of June. Global Vigil. People around the world have been remembering those who died in the Orlando nightclub shooting. In New York, there was a sea of candlelight as the names of the victims were read out. The Eiffel Tower in France and the Harbour Bridge in Sydney were lit up in rainbow colours. A minute silence was held in London and the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge signed a book of condolence. A reminder that terror attacks like this are very rare, but if you're worried, please speak to an adult who you trust. Football violence. Six England football fans have been jailed and another has been banned from matches for five years after violence at Euro 2016. French police had to use water cannon and dogs to break up fighting as England played Russia. Unfortunately, football has a long history of fighting between both clubs and countries. Both the UK government and UEFA have condemned the violence and threatened to kick countries out of the competition if it continues. School places. New figures from the government show that just over 84% of 11-year-olds got a place at their first choice of secondary school this year. And when it comes to primary schools, 88.4% of children got the school they wanted. Rain warning. Severe weather warnings have been issued for some parts of the country as heavy rain is expected. Wales, northwest England, Yorkshire, the Midlands and the east of England are all set for downpours. There's also a risk of flooding.